hello guys and welcome to another after effects tutorial in this video i'm going to show you how to export videos in adobe after effects so first of all when you are done with your editing over here you can see your composition tab over here so what you need to do is to come over here to composition and come down here and click add to render queue and you will notice that a new tab has been created here for you a render queue tab and with this render queue tab you are greeted with four different settings over here the first one you will click is this best settings over here you leave your quality as best settings, resolution as full. This is the size I edited the video with. Yours will most likely be somewhere around 1080 by 1920 or whatever composition you worked with. So basically, this settings is always the best settings for you. So I'll just hit OK. So you come over here to this high quality over here. And for your format, you can either export as AVI or as QuickTime or any of the presets you prefer here. If you want to export as a PNG file, you select PNG. For MP3 audio, you can use MP3 or WAV for high quality MP3. But for video, you most likely want to use the AVI or the QuickTime. But if you cannot find the QuickTime in your After Effects, I'll be dropping the link in the description for you to download the QuickTime preset and install it to your After Effects. Make sure that your video output here is checked. Now for your channels, you have three channels to choose from. You can select RGB, Alpha or RGB plus Alpha. This is not coming up at the moment. So with RGB plus Alpha, you are going to be able to export transparent background videos. But if you don't want to export transparent background video, just click on RGB. Ignore the resize over here. Ignore the crop option over here. You can come over to your audio output and leave it at 48,000 kHz. Then for the bits, you can make it 32 bits for a very high quality. And for this option, leave it as stereo and hit OK. You come over to this blue line over here and you select the location and the name of your file. So over here, I can select it to be exported to my desktop and I can save this as export video, for example, and hit save. All right, so now you come over to render over here. But before you click render, turn on your caps lock and hit render. And this will automatically increase the speed of your export but if you do not activate the caps lock it's going to take a longer period of time to export as you can see it took a very short period to render and export that file over here and if you come over to my desktop here we can see the file that i've exported and that's it guys for now to export videos in adobe after effect i hope you found this tutorial very useful if you did kindly give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and drop your feedbacks in the comment section thank you and see you guys in my next video tomorrow